or where this vlog is going to go, but I thought I would. What the? Oh, there's a bloody dog. Oh. Life with JSR vlog, this is number one. Today, I thought I would start it off. At, at the moment, now I'm using my iPhone. I haven't really documented my journey on an iPhone before, but uh, we'll see how things go. Now, today, it's on a Thursday today, and it's just after 12.30, right? It's 12.40 right now, and I actually took Grace to work. Uh, she's got a new job working at a call center. And so I ended up taking her there and then I ended up getting my second workout in. And then after finishing my second workout, um, here I am. Uh, I'm actually in Pennant Hills. For my first ever vlog, I thought it'd be a great idea, um, you know, to document, I guess, I guess a new change that I'm going through right now. And you know, currently right now we're still in the lockdown. So technically I'm, I'm technically I'm not meant to be here, but obviously there's, there's a reason, there's a reason as to why I'm in Pennant Hills. I'm from Western Sydney, so I'm way beyond like the five let alone k five let alone 10k i wanted to document this part because this is something that i have been very scared of um i'm not really i'm not as I, I'm, I'm excited but i'm also scared and the reason why i'm scared is because i'm currently going into a, a new season um, of me being you know jay sign uh, one of that thing is uh, i'm actually you know planning on moving out i'm moving out of home so uh, currently right now i'm living i'm living with my mum and my little brother and my little sister and i've been living with them for the past two years and i'm i've come to the season now where i i actually want to live uh, independently and live on my own uh, is it scary 100 percent. i am so scared i'm not gonna lie i was in central and we drove from central all the way to here which is in Penn hills it probably took me uh, 30 40 minutes to get here from central and as i was driving here I, I was just yeah not gonna lie thinking you know i was looking around the area and being like i don't know if this is me and i feel like that happens right that, that like i feel like that's a normal thing it's a normal thing for you to go through a moments of questioning and that's what happens when you when you place fear into your life or you allow fear to take control of you and I'm not going to lie, like I, I am allowing that in some sort of way to control me. But today, today I just said to myself, now you know what, I'm going to, I'm going to rely on faith. I'm going to rely on my faith and I'm going to believe in that, um, you know, whatever God does, steers me, I'm, I'm, I'm heading towards it. So this is one of the things that I'm going to be doing. Now, um, right now I am waiting because I've actually got an, uh, a house inspection at my very first uh, potential home. And uh, this home, it's uh, it's a one bedroom. There's one bedroom in there, and there's also a just a one whole room that has a kitchen. Uh, hopefully, I'll be able to share some footage of it. And then after that, there's a bathroom. The cool thing is, is that it's actually outside. So I personally, I personally don't want to get like I don't want to get an apartment. Um, I want to get like some sort of a granny flat. So I'm 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 keen. Like I'm so keen to you know hopefully check this out. Hopefully, fingers crossed. Like if I do end up getting the approval, and they say yeah we want you i'm actually going to be moving in you know straight away and um hopefully i get to document it i'm not too sure exactly how it's crazy though because i don't really have much of a plan i'm just going in a day by day step by step and i think the big thing that i have done right now is i have taken the bold uh the bold step not the bold leap of faith but the bold step of faith to go out of my way uh to you know look into doing things independently i, I feel that freedom I think, you know, I've spoken to guys and the gals out there that are doing things on their own. And they say, they, they say to me, Josh, there is no such freedom um, than the freedom that you get to do whatever you want to do, especially when it comes to living on your own. So I'm excited. I'm actually excited to also meet the, the tenant um, and also meet uh, the real estate agents that will be, I guess, conducting the inspection. But I'm um, not going to lie, I'm actually so hot. Um, after that second workout, I actually ended up running through uh, Central. I should have just documented some stuff. Anyways, so I guess while I'm waiting, let me just share to you just something that I was eating. So let's check this out. So I ended up buying this, right, which is a Quest birthday cake flavor. 
not gonna lie, this is actually this is actually quite tasty. Uh, will I rate it out of ten? Hmm. I would say I'll give it an eight. The reason why I'm giving it an eight is because it, after eating this, I I now want to go to the toilet, like, <laughs> and I don't know if it's rude for me to go to the toilet at the place. Yeah, let me just share to you actually just a bit. You know, as I was driving through, I seen that there were some real key areas. First key area that I'd seen driving through was Anytime Fitness. Anytime Fitness is actually, if you look over here, it's like that way. So if I drive down all the way down there and then just turn left, then I'll be on um, Pennant Hills Road. And yeah, the Anytime Fitness is literally just there. Um, also too, there's a KFC, which I'm like, nah, that is not good. That is not good for me, that the KFC is literally right around the corner. Um, and then also too, back behind me, I'll probably just use my mirror. As in the, so if you go back, right? If you go back that way, um, it's, I think there's like a park or like a forest or something um, over there. So very different, very different. It's not to my cup of tea, not gonna lie. I'm more of like a city-like person. So being out of the area is quite interesting. <laughs> Actually, um, I'm just hot at the moment and wanting to go to the toilet. So <sighs> we'll just pray wait now, we'll pray wait. So we're currently here right now, that's, neighbors apparently um right here behind us is a daycare um but yeah we're getting close to the time too i think he's already here i think it's a guy actually oh at least we're here dude what i want to do is i'm going to record it and just tell him that like i'm showing you for my my family so yeah let's see how it goes Right, so this is the house all right so i actually got the all clear so this is how it looks so this is the kitchen and um, the stove it's gas and i'm for sure we've got the oven here um obviously the tap normal tap wait okay okay that's all right so guys this is gonna be potentially my new home so Let's check it out. So this right here is the room. So this is currently the room at the moment. This is the view from outside my room. Okay, the car dealership. So currently right now I'm in the bedroom. This is where potentially I'm going to be sleeping. The cool thing about this home is that it's got two, uh, two power points. You need to, this is the view from outside. So we're, we literally live over the car place. It's cool. So this is the wardrobe. Wardrobe's looking good. Check out the other side. Okay. This is not too bad. Let's check out the lighting. Okay. Lighting is probably not going to be good, to be honest. That's okay. Alright. So that's the one bedroom. And then here. We've got here the outside hallway, which is actually pretty clean. So, my only issue, my only issue, yes. So this is the sink. This is, uh, I'm guessing, storage. Yep, I saw something there. I don't know what this will be. Let's figure it out. Obviously this is the bathroom. Shower head. Okay. Yep. And obviously the toilet. And me. Oh yep. 
Okay. So that's probably the only thing that they're missing is an aircon. Now the question is, I can potentially just get a built-in one. Okay. All right, all right. Looking at the last ones. All right. So yeah, last one, one, this is the crew. This is a shower. All right, so we just finished up. So crazy enough, I thought it was that house, but it wasn't actually. Um, so we just finished off the, let me get in the car, where it's actually hot as. Woo. All right, so we just finished up and um, it wasn't too bad. That's a little too bad. Obviously, I just done a bit of the footage and video. Um, the good thing about the guy is that he allowed me to record. I don't know if he allowed to, um, but I ended up just doing that. Um, bro, I'm bloody sweating. So yeah, the real estate agent was actually a guy. The girl couldn't come down, which is, which is all good. And um, yeah, the good thing about the house is that it's there's like a hall. Or like there's like a, a ramp like a walkway all the way down so um that, that's quite okay and then obviously there's a so it's crazy because like in in the uh in the advertisement they share one so there's one bedroom there's one shower and there's one garage now it doesn't say garage it says carport so um even i, I don't even necessarily need a gym to be honest um but it was just like, oh, I actually thought it was going to be a garage. But it is what it is. Um, my my goal at the moment is just to obviously see how this um, goes for me. Obviously, i got to apply. They just gave me this, all right, which is the rental tenancy application that I've actually got to pull on through. Um, so, yeah, things are actually going, things are actually moving. Now, the only, like, so there's a lot of pros to this, right? Um, the pros to... The, yeah, so the pros, so the good thing about, um, you know, coming here is a few things. Number one, like the neighborhood, it's actually quite quiet. Uh, there's also like in the, I didn't realize that there's actually another room. There's actually another room, but it's a laundry. So you got the laundry, you got the shower. The shower looks pretty good, like the toilet. Uh, it looks kind of like modernized. And then we've got uh, the kitchen. Good thing is it's that, uh, the good thing is that it's gas. Uh, so we got that. Uh, what else is there that we got? Uh, it's quite spacious, right? We've got like a hallway. It's just like the hallway, my room, the the shower, and then the laundry. So um, also too, they've got a, a they've already got a line. So that's that's pretty good. My only my only concern is that there's grass. That's my only concern. I don't know how that's gonna work out. I don't know who's gonna cut the grass, but this is where I guess some of the cons that I've seen, and I've got to weigh it out to see if it's actually worth, um, you know, worth the investment. So, at the moment now, my goal are the cons. So, I guess the downfall behind this place is number one: there's no aircon. So, I don't know how I'm gonna work out with that because I do need. <laughs> I do need the place for some, like, you know, to, to be cold. Um, yeah, because I don't know how I'm going to last in the summer if I was going to have that. So that was one con. Another con to, to this place is that there's... Another con to, to the place is that it's combined to another home. So it's literally connected to another home. Now, I don't know how that's going to work out, to be honest. Um... But hey, it is what it is. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. What I'll do is I'll. I'll probably need to think about it actually. Probably think about it this afternoon, and then making a decision at the end of the day. But um, yeah. But hey, you know what we're gonna do right now? We're gonna celebrate our wins, and what we're gonna do first is we're actually gonna go to KFC and get some lunch uh, to you know wrap up this vlog for today. The very first vlog live with Jason. 
and then yeah i'm hungry but guys that's pretty much it that's all we got thank you all for jumping on and uh i can't wait to continue documenting my journey so yeah take care guys peace <laughs>